All right, guys, got a new property here at the, what is this, November the 17th? New property. A little bit of side yard. I don't want to go too far in the back, but just want to show you overgrown edges. And, uh, yeah. So I'll be taking the, uh, first time being edged probably in a while so I'll be taking the edger out which uh, they have Bermuda in the backyard so I won't have to touch that they won't they don't want me to touch the Bermuda but yeah this is it try to record a little bit of it so you guys can kind of see me clean it up some but probably won't get all of it that's okay Got some trash. But we're gonna try to get it cleaned up and uh, get out of here. It's a uh, very cold November. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, picking up two uh, properties this week. Picked up two brand new properties and uh, yeah as you can see a lot of it's dormancy but there's a lot of it that is uh I'm sorry if i'm out of focus here a lot of it is uh fescue but there's a lot of bermuda in it too so i'm going to go ahead and knock this one out for my customer and get it done so stay tuned
as you guys can see and now I'm about to start mowing I'm not gonna record this part of it but I'll try to remember to bring you guys back after and uh, it's really windy out here today cold and windy so I haven't really cleaned out the edges that good I just try to get the grass back at least somewhat in I'll clean it up with my uh, 8010 8, 800 and 10 and uh, get some of this uh, back in the water. So stay tuned, bring you guys back with a finish. All right guys, just got done and uh, it's looking pretty good. The edges could be a little bit tighter, but it's okay. Um, as I was finishing up, look at the proper, oh, let, me, let me get the camera angle right. As I was finishing up the property, check out these edges. Don't worry about the mud, of course, that'll wash away. But uh, the customer right there, that house came over, drove by, and wanted to know if I could uh, edge out his property. So I'm gonna go knock his out real quick. And I gotta get that water hose back up. But I'm gonna knock it out real quick. And I take a couple of pictures for the customer. I think they're gonna like it. I think they're gonna like it a lot. So, yep, looks pretty good. Stay tuned. All right, guys, here go another one. It's a property that I was just doing down there, and I'm up here now. He's got uh, the sidewalk. He's talking about he want me to maybe maintain just the sidewalk. Um. It is overgrown and uh, let's see if we can get it back in shape. All right. Now stay tuned. Alright guys, this is kind of what I was talking about before in uh, my previous video of why we got the air rate. We got this good old North Carolina, um, it's not mud, it's clay. And it gets stuck like anything like this. Super easy. It's not back there, I just cleared it out. So. Got this clay. It's really hard. Check it out.
there is that's how much I took off the pavement and as you can see all the way down it's like a shadow all the way down on both sides a lot of that orange dirt exactly what it is it's just that clay it's hard it gets compacted easily and uh, it's just not good soil here but uh got them all cleaned up and uh, here, let's go up here to the front just want to show you guys real quick the edges and you can see that is all cleaned up all done let's see what we got here Yep. Yeah. So, I took my number. I don't know what that means, but maybe I'll get another client here. Who knows? Okay. Uh, was not planning on doing that today, but hey, make a little extra money. I just did the uh, edges because that's all he wanted. He was gonna weed and trim and all that stuff. I think he, I think he said he already mowed, but it's not terribly bad. But it could use a little more to neaten it up. <sighs> but yeah, um, and that's how fast you guys can get new clients out here, even in the fall. So. People see you out, they see your work. Now, I don't even know how he saw my work. Well, I mean, it's two houses down, but still. We uh, just knocked it out for him. And uh, who knows, who knows what, what might come from this. So, all right guys, stay tuned. I got a few more uh, properties to go take care of today. Not a whole lot. I was hoping to get aeration done, but honestly, it can probably wait till tomorrow. No, I really can't wait till tomorrow because I need to get it done today. I don't think I'll get it done because of how late it is. It's, it's like 2.41 right now. So, which means I got about two more, two and a half more hours of light. Well, not even that, maybe. It starts getting dark around 4.30, 5 o'clock. But uh, yeah, uh, being out here, being active is one of the best things you can, what, one of the best things you can do for some of your clients. I understand further up north you can't do it, and even here at a certain time you can't do it, but uh, as much as possible, you wanna stay as active as possible uh, in these neighborhoods and stuff. So I am going to head back um, towards, uh, I usually like to work farthest away first and then closer back into town or closer back to my house if that makes sense that way I, I won't be that far away but anyway uh, y'all stay tuned this is quality lawn care fit for king